हेलो एवरी वन फाइनली माइक्रोसॉफ्ट हैज अनाउंस द रिलीज डेट ऑफ विंडोज 11 अपग्रेड 23H2. थ्री एच टू इट इज रिलीजिंग ऑन ट्वेंटी सिक्स सेप्टेंबर इन दिस वीडियो यू विल गेट टू नो वाई यू मस्ट अपग्रेड टू दिस वर्जन इन माई प्रीवियस वीडियो एड सोन सम ग्रेट फीचर्स लाइक विंडोज को पायलट एंड हाउ यू कैन गेट द अर्ली एक्सेस यूजिंग विंडोज इंसेडर्स प्रोग्राम एंड इन दिस वीडियो आई विल शोइंग फ्यू मोर फीचर्स सो डू वॉच दिस वीडियो टिल द एंड You can check for all the apps and its update status in Microsoft Store. Let's check it out. It is the Microsoft Store. Go to Library and click on Get Updates. So these are the new updates of uh, all the apps uh, in my PC. You can see these are downloading and also installing in my system. So it is to make sure that all your apps are updated. So the first update is the background removal feature in MS Paint. and here we have the new remove background feature so first import an image to our canvas i'll take this photo then just click on remove background and within few seconds you can see the background is removed if anything is left then you can select an area i'll select this and again click on remove background if still it is left then again select a part and click on remove background okay perfect so now you can see the background has been removed completely it's a great image editing feature now you don't have to go for any external software you can right away use this ms paint and do this now in this photo i can change the background using any other image let's select an image which we want as a background let me take this image uh, i'll use this image as the background and now i'll import my photo i'll import this and i can just resize this to fit the background yeah so now you can see the new image there is my photo and the new background is right here The next major update is copy text from a screenshot using snipping tool. Let's go to snipping tool. Now let me uh, take a screenshot something like this. Now our new feature is right here that is text actions. Click here and here we have two options copy all text and quick redact. Let's click on copy all text. and we can paste that all the text in a notepad like this if you want to copy a part of it so like this you can just copy using control c and we can paste like this now let's come to the other option that is quick redact and here we have two things email address and phone numbers checked that means If you have any private data like uh, an email address or phone numbers, then it will automatically identify that. And if we click on Quick Redact, it will just hide those data. Also, we have an option Edit in Paint, so you can see how it is increasing the productivity and it is saving our effort and time. The next big update is Auto Save feature in Notepad. so like we have uh, pasted uh, this text in this notepad so now we don't need to save this we can simply close it and when the next time we'll open the notepad it will open from our last session but earlier we had to save it so it was taking our time and effort but now it is it has eliminated that and now we can just quickly say, uh, quickly close it and next time when we will open the notepad it will open from that place you can also create new tabs like this and you can put your data something something and when you will close it it will simply close and next time it will open from there so this setting is available here when notepad starts here we have two options open content from the previous session or open a new window so open a new window is the previous one it will ask you to save and this one is the current update again it's a productivity feature so these are the major updates in the existing apps of windows 
one more update is in the settings if we go to the settings you can see there is a new tab introduced called home so in the home tab you can see all the quick settings are present here so these are the new major features of uh, windows 11 in that is coming in 23h2 there are so many other uh, few features uh, that we'll see when it will completely release so don't forget to upgrade your windows os it is going to be a free upgrade so these are the new features you'll be getting on this update so definitely you should upgrade your windows os and thanks for watching hope you enjoyed this video and do check out the previous video about windows 11 23 h2 and for more windows related videos please click on this playlist and thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in my next video